Hello everybody, I'm here with Brian Rollins. He's the family business manager of the Jira Product Group here at Atlassian. Thanks for being here, Dirk. It's always great to have you guys at Summit. Thank you. Um, yesterday, your CEO launched a new product uh, called Jira Service Desk. Absolutely um, right. So can you tell me a little bit more about Jira Service Desk? What, was it, what is it meant for? What are the key benefits for the clients? Absolutely. Jira Service Desk is a really exciting offering. It's, it's our first offering for uh, really IT teams, for, specifically focused on Service Desk. And um, we brought what I think is the most mature offering we've, we've ever developed at Alassian to help Service Desk teams. We talk about helping them go home early, but there's really two aspects of this. One is uh, we think we've created a great end user experience for all those users who need to submit tickets to get laptops repaired, get access to systems, all those IT requests that come in. And at the same time, we think we've developed uh, an amazing suite of tools for the team themselves. So great SLAs, clear priority queues, and, and really configurable that, that they want to configure it, um, bringing all that power of the JIRA platform with workflows and JQL, um, but then specifically responding to the needs of all those service desk teams. Um, many of whom have been using JIRA as a service desk for years, and this is really giving them that last mile of functionality to, to give them the best possible experience. Yeah, I like the idea of uh, making the IT service teams go home earlier. That yeah. is a very good but, message and uh, you added less and you're really devoted at making development teams, making IT teams more productive. Uh, but I see uh, many good application areas for service desk in non-IT areas. So what are you using service desk for at Atlassian and what do you know of your uh, clients? Yeah, it's, it's, it's amazing. At Atlassian we found more uses for service desk than, uh, than we'd possibly imagined at the beginning. We, we actually use it to capture uh, requests for re recognizing other employees. So we call it our kudos program. So you can nominate another employee because they went the extra mile for you in the last release or, or they made a great event like Summit. Uh, go off so well, so you submit one of those requests. You don't necessarily need to see the internals of what that team does to process those requests. You just want to know that you submitted a request and, and it was accepted. But there are a lot of other applications, so um, we have a foundation leave program, so you submit a request so you can actually do some charitable work and the company gives you holiday time for that. So it's amazing how almost any non-technical or business process, um, people have actually embraced Service Desk to use that. Now most of our customers, as, as they've embraced it, it's been Service Desk uh, very much in a traditional IT sense, um, but we know that there are a lot of other applications that they've been using Jira for, whether it's HR processes or sales or marketing, anything, uh, and we expect that uh, you know we'll see people using Service Desk for those as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy to introduce Service Desk to our clients because I think there is a great potential for using Service Desk throughout the company uh, for IT help desk, but also for any other help desk or self-service uh, area. Yeah, as always, when we introduce a technology, we, we try to make it relatively general, even though we focus on a specific persona, and I expect the same thing to be true of Service Desk. And last year's summit, Atlassian Enterprise, was a big topic. Uh, this year we are learning that enterprise is now being built into, well, any business area of Atlassian, into any team. Right. Uh, so from your perspective, uh, what are the most important takeaways, uh, the most important announcement this year for enterprise clients? Sure. Well, I think there have been a lot of individual features that we've built for enterprise customers, and we talked about a lot in a lot of those State of the Unions, but there's certainly a couple of things that we, we talked about very briefly that we're going to be working on in the future that I think will be really interesting, especially to our largest enterprise customers. Um, one area, even with the great advances we've made with in Jira 5.1 and Jira 5.2 around scale and some of the front-end scale in Jira 6.0, we see amazing growth. I mean, we're growing at Alassian. Our customers are growing even faster in a lot of cases. And so as a result, our, our journey in improving Jira scale is, is not done by any stretch of the imagination. And so we're looking, um, in fact, we've even started working on a new offering for enterprise customers that combines the notions of high availability and scale and archiving for capacity management. Um, because we know more and more customers, they've standardized on Jira. It's now their solution for um, IT, for development, and, and like you mentioned, Dirk, even other business applications. And so we we want to support those customers and give something so that, that they can scale further and further and, and use Jira throughout their whole organization. So that's really exciting. Another thing that we've started looking at um, is how can we can give project teams more control. Um, and so the ability to, to give a project admin rights. Um, in fact, if you look at Service Desk, you'll actually see that project administrators can configure all the features of Service Desk. So they don't need to rely and harass their Jira administrator. We'd like to give more and more project admins control over Jira configuration, but just, of course, relating to their project. And then we want to couple that with giving auditing capabilities to Jira administrators so they have clear visibility of all the changes that those individual teams may be making. And, and we know a lot of enterprise customers, something they've been asking for 
for. And that's what's always great at Summit is uh, you get to show what we've worked on over the last year that specifically customers have asked for. So it's always a treat to, to get the rounds of applause and bring that back to the development team for all their hard work. So it's really a good time uh, for enterprise clients to take a look at the new version 6.0. 6.1 just released last week, yeah, some great yeah. features there, developed very specifically for uh, for enterprise customers like workflow scheme drafts is something we had in, in 6.0, of course rename user uh, right. is out there, the number two, you know, all time most voted feature request. Yeah. So Thank you for that one. It. Hey, uh, th 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 thank the customers for all the feedback, and of course with that one we want to step further with enterprise customers, and right. it not only works uh, with, with uh, standalone Jira, but it works with enterprise directories like yeah. LDOP and Active Directory, so that's a, that's a really important one for that's some of our important. largest customers, yeah, absolutely. So apart from specific functionality, uh, what is it that you are maybe most excited about here at Atlassian Summit this year? Well, at every summit it's always great to just connect with individual customers, but I think the, the rate at which Jira is growing inside of our customers is just absolutely tremendous, where a customer who I talked to uh, for the first time at Summit two years ago was saying, hey, we're getting close to half a million issues, and now they're at 2.5 million issues. And it's not just about issues, it's about the fact that Jira has actually become a standard in our organization, and we're enabling them to run it with more and more and more teams. Um, so that's probably the, the, the thing that I see the most is uh, the growth and progression in each of our customers and how they're using Jira for new things that we didn't even imagine uh, in the past. So uh, that's always exciting. Now, of course, from an Atlassian announce announcement perspective, I'd, I'd have to say Jira Service Desk, of course, is something that I've been <laughs> yeah. incredibly excited about. And it's been tough to keep a lid on it uh, for the last couple of months. Uh, but now, finally, it's out of the bag, and we can, we can talk to all of our customers about it. Excellent. Brian, thank you for the interview. Have a good uh, last half day here at uh, Atlassian Likewise, Summit 2013. Jared, thank you so much for everything Communardo does for the uh, Atlassian community and enterprise. And we always love getting to meet Communardo customers because they're such a great source of feedback. Back. So uh, thanks again for everything that you guys do for the Elastic community. Well, thank you. And we, we have to give the thank you back to our enterprise Absolutely. clients in Germany. Thank you uh, so much for your support and being part of the community. Keep the questions, feedback, um, participation in early access programs. Uh, that's so valuable to us. We really appreciate it. I'm sure they will. Excellent. Thank you very much, Brian. Have a great afternoon, Dirk. And you. Take thank care. you.